Welcome to Crazy Town's 10 Minutes or Less. I'm Jonas. And I'm TNT Dynamite, the explosive one. Set the timer. <laughs> so TNT. What? I, uh, I'm, I'm going to be real here. I am not a big fan of dating sites in general. Okay. But my question is, since pandemic, now that we've hit pandemic two years, yeah. it's not really easy to go out and meet. A lady or a man, if you're whatever you, you know, you want to date. I don't know what you're trying oh. to insinuate for me. <laughs> All I'm saying is, but yes, I know that I, both I, I of us see where you're going. have been dabbling on Tinder during the pandemic. Well, it's funny you should bring that up, Jonas. I actually just went on a Tinder date today. Oh, nice. Yeah. So I, I, I have to admit, I, I've been dabbling on a Tinder, as, yes. as, you, as you alluded to, and um, met a young lady. Had a good time. You know, we went out and we ate. It was very adult though. Like adult dating in general is pretty like It's dude. weird, it's dude. It's like it's like weird. you're all like, How was your crocheting this week? And you're like Great <laughs> great. I worked and then you crocheted me a sweater. I honestly think it's just because like adults don't do anything. Yeah. <laughs> it's like what do you even talk about? Oh yeah, I don't absolutely. Know. I don't know. But as far as the experience went. It was it was pretty cut and dry. It was pretty basic. Like Tinder is really just like for me, it's just a way to meet the person because right. it, it's hard to meet people anymore, and especially yeah. during this. Well, pre COVID, I was going out and doing stuff and meeting people and stuff. But like, mm -hmm. uh, I have lots of problems with online dating. Oh yeah, list some of them. Jones, well, give well, me here, some of your problems. Here's my here's something that just happened to me recently. I okay. just actually recently deleted my Tinders. I'm going on a break for a little bit. I might go back in like a month maybe. That's fair. So, there was a girl, we we matched and uh she had like 10 pictures and they were so varying. It here was we go. it was Here we go. It was there was like seven different hair colors. Mm -hmm different hair links mm. there was like in some she was fairly thin some she was kind of chubby like, there was a whole variety of like whatever and i don't i, Just I matched with her basically different people right and i matched with her so i mean obviously like i found her interesting enough by her profile and so i asked her like I didn't want to just straight up and be like, which picture is most recent? So I was yeah, like, oh, yeah. what's your hair look like now? Because obviously you got purple, you got green, some the side shape, some it's long, whatever. And she replies back, oh, it's brown and, you know, long. And I'm like, okay. So whatever. So anyways, I was like, well, uh, we ended up jumping over to Snapchat. And I was like, <laughs> and I was like, okay. I was like, hey, here's a picture of me today. I was like, why don't you shoot me a picture? So I know, so like, I always like to know I'm talking to the person I think I'm talking to. Absolutely. She sends me a picture. This zoomed up on her face. If you're not watching this live on our YouTube channel, mm -hmm. Crazy Town Media, uh, <laughs> it's like her, just her face. And she has on a mask, a COVID mask. So, so I get her eyes. COVID branded mask. Yeah, it's a COVID brand mask. <laughs> it's COVID. And so it. like, literally I got the picture, I got the picture and I never talked to her again. I was like. I if mean, you're that afraid of what you look like, why are you on dating sites to begin with? All right, Jonas. I have a reason for you as to why she might have done this. And I, I'm, all, I'm all here. I just, I'm like, dude, I'm just trying to make sure you who you, you're who you say you are. All right. I, I was thinking about this while you were talking. I was like, wow, this behavior is very indicative of a body snatcher. <laughs> oh, excuse me? She's going to steal me? Yeah, she's a body snatcher. That's why she was in different bodies, oh. essentially. <laughs> oh, like she's the literally whole a, yeah. a transient. Yeah, because she only hangs out in the body and absorbs its nutrients until it's a, a withered husk, and then she moves on like to the Like a succubus. End. Except, yes, except stealing life energy through just inhabiting. Oh, okay. She jumps into the body instead of just, like, blowing the life energy out of the body like a succubus does. Okay, that's I what succubus is. But, uh... Yeah, so you were you you dodged a bullet because she would have inhabited your body and yeah, right. But I just feel like she was a knew. catfish, man. That's what that was. Well, right, she that's knew real talk. What I want, she's like, he wants to see what I look like because I have nine different pictures on my profile, and so I'm gonna be coy and send him one with my face covered with a mask. And I was just like, I'm done. I'm like, no, dude, I can't. <laughs> it's like, hard to get that perfect shot. We were talking about this the other day, though. It's yeah, hard to get that perfect shot. Yeah. Oh, it really is hard. Well, here's the thing. I was talking to somebody about it. You're trying to convince someone mm. that has. Literally, we live in Austin, so there's a million people in the city. Has thousands upon thousands of people to swipe through. That by your first photo they see, 
that you're worth talking to. Mm. It doesn't matter what you put in your profile. It doesn't matter. Mm. It's like you're literally going by one, three seconds of would I bang this person is essentially what people think. Wow. You know, when you put it like that, it is a very, like, carnal and visceral thing. Oh, absolutely. Where it's just like, does this hunk of meat in front of me do Spur anything? Me enough to at least read about them. Yeah. Like, did this make my, my, my dick jump at least, like, one time? Did it, is <laughs> that I guess what happened? But my point is, it's like, in, I know this when I'm swiping. Some of the pictures people put up, they're just, like, they're, they're, they look depressing. They're like, <laughs> and I, and I don't, I, dude, I swear to God, I don't mean this in a negative way. <laughs> it, it's like, they're, they're, there's no light. They have five pictures. It's like they're in the same seat in all five pictures yeah. in, like, five different shirts. It's like you could, like, take those and lay them over top of each other, and they're all the same. <laughs> You're like you're trying to portray your personality, but you know what? That's the real person. That's what I have to say. There is that that's a real person right there. That person that only has like that one picture of them in the same outfit in like four different poses. That's a real person who was just like, all right, I'm gonna put up a tender. They didn't do a bunch of different because then you have the ones that have an Instagram and they have all these like professionally done filtered photos with like makeup tools right. and everything. Like that's I don't who, want that. who connects their social media to their dating profile. Oh man, lots of girls. I would not do that. Lots of them. Well, that's cause, well, yeah, because then they can just be they can throw all their they can go go check out my. Hey, I'm just I'm gonna keep it a buck with you, Jones. I think a lot of them girls is escorts. I do. Really? I, I think a lot of. I mean, look, everybody's an escort if the price is right. So dudes, dudes and, that, and, that, and I know you're not being misogynist about I'm women, not. like dudes too. Yeah, I'd be an escort if the price was right. Yeah. I'm waiting to be somebody's little escort. Well, I've said this for a long time. I think I think a lot of times, a lot of the girls that are on the dating site, probably guys too, are just seeking validation. They're not really looking to date anybody. No, they just yeah, want to know yeah. that people think they're hot and are interested in yeah. them, but they have no. No, I qualm to like actually have a conversation or whatever. They're just like, oh, he that, thinks I'm cute, whatever. That's fair. That's fair. I wonder what degree of industry that needs like that pretty girl for like a music video or for a co or for like a commercial or even for like a party or something. Like they're having a like an extra, like or yeah, yeah whatever, yeah, or yeah. something like that. I wonder what degree of those industry uses Tinder to find somebody for that. Because I mean, look, man. We live in Austin. We go on, I go on Tinder. There are a ton of hot girls. And like there you're are tons. Well, and the thing is, like, you can tell it's like you almost think they're fake because they all have all professional photos on their thing. And you're that like, part. you live in Indonesia and you are not even a, a woman. Like, you're just a dude. And see, and I'm wondering, like, if they do that because they're like, there's a potential that some rich guy is going to see this, look at their Insta, be like, I need to meet this girl. Could be. I don't know, man. I don't, I like, wonder what, like, the motive is on a lot of stuff. Like, because I'm not, like, I, I know some people use Tinder just for hookups. Yeah. And I know some people want to use Tinder to, like, meet someone they could potentially have a lifelong relationship with. Oh, wow. I just want to, like, meet people and hang out with them. And, like, if they're cool, keep hanging out with them. And maybe we'll that's, date. Maybe we won't. Yeah, like, that's kind of what I'm on it for, too. Even even though I did go on, like, an official date, I'm it's, it's nothing serious. Right. And right now it's so hard with COVID, like, mm -hmm. to go out and, like, you can't go out to the bar and, like, Absolutely I mean, you, you can. Lots of people do. But, like, you know, it's. I yeah. don't know, dude. It's a whole different thing. So I think COVID Tinder is so much different than regular Tinder. Uh, how how is it different? What uh, where where do you see? You know, difference? okay. Let me let me do a little throwback. Pre vaccine, when people were really hunkering down, <laughs> and it was early, like early, er, early COVID okay, when like when okay, they were like okay, shut okay. down the world. Me and you both got on Tinder to see. I wonder who's on here. There was still and there some were people, people are like going pictures going out to the club, and I'm like. So there's a, a virus out here. We don't know how bad it is. It's killing people all over the place. There's no vaccine, and you're out the club every weekend. <laughs> I'm like, hey, you know, they live in their best life, man. <laughs> yeah, it was just it's They're interesting. Their best like, life. it's I just think online dating in general is. So weird. what's the difference between like? Uh, so you mean like is it just because of like the degree of? Oh. Well, that's it. All well, right, everybody. That's all the time we have for today's episode. Go to thecrazytown.com and subscribe. For Jonas. TNT. Uh, we're out.